so in this video now let's finish off uh, the next section so this one please find the courses we offer and this thing so this is actually uh, another section uh, it is uh, a row a single column this is one row okay and the next row we have these three and next row we have these three so in one section we have three rows so let's start with this part now so we finish this so back to here here after this intro section 2 let's add a comments uh, courses section it's not courses actually it's a gallery so let's add a section <coughs> the class called p4 and bg any bg is there bg is teal so bg teal text by default is doc and keep it text center because everything is center and inside you write one container one row single column and you have a text please find the courses we offer as below that's a h2 paste it so the sec yeah we got it and below that you can write p with the class called leader let's just take uh, lorem some 10 words tab you get some 10 dummy words and below this next row we have three images exactly these three angular node and bootstrap so uh, uh, below this i need another row and uh, first column call md4 inside i write an image src images folder slash angular and uh, give the class image fluid and uh, image with thumbnail and uh, my own class name i write as uh, gallery image and let's take an alt alt is uh, you can write angular or just keep it empty fine i got image but it's not completely rounded and some border so let's make that part now so i have a class called gallery image my custom class so back to style sheet yeah here i write slash star uh, gallery section so gallery section so i write gallery image uh, to be border radius some 50 pixels i think it's rounded and some border i write i write some border mm, some 5 pixels solid my this color okay let's add a uh, important uh it's not working because of i think uh, thumbnail just remove the thumbnail we have to use our own uh, border so yeah we got a border but you can't see that because background also same let's write some box shadow uh box shadow zero zero some 10 pixels and black you get some shadow yes this is what it is and when i keep a cursor i want to make little zoom that's a scale so i write dot uh, gallery image colon hover i write so transformation scale uh, 1.05 comma 1.05 and let's check the key by cursor it become like this but it's very fast and i have to make it slowly you can write uh, a transition all 0.5 seconds some 0.5 seconds uh, transition time so in 0.5 seconds this effect we gonna happen so uh, yes i got it and i need to have a cursor pointer uh, you can write here only the cursor pointer so whenever you hover you get the hand symbol okay looks good fine so it's finished so let's start with the next one uh, so this is same like uh, another two again back to here i just simply copy the column d4 paste it and paste it so you get three images but i want uh, this is uh, node.js so just change the image node.js and here it is bootstrap fine and same like this in the next row we need react mongodb and html so i'll do one thing at the whole row i'll copy next row same so copy paste 
and you get this but I need to add some margin top uh, for the row margin top 4 and each icon uh, to change so that is react mongodb html so this is gonna be the react this is gonna be the mongodb and this is some um, web technologies yeah so I got the images change so this is about a gallery section and below this we have another section I think it is uh, this much so learn more about and one button so this is uh, I think it's it's nine column layout and it is three column layout okay so let's make this part and background is um, black background is dark color so let's below this add a comment so learn more section let's write a section section with the class called bg uh, dark and text i write teal and text center and some padding i write uh, p4 as a padding and in this one container one row container spelling wrong container row uh, call let's say call md uh, nine column layouts and other one is call uh, md um, three column layouts so nine column layout we have this text copy um, I read some h3 paste check once yeah you got it actually here white color right it should be actually teal color so I made teal color and below that I write some paragraph p with the class called leader let's say lorem uh, some eight tab some eight words fine looks good and then uh, right side we need to have um, uh, an outline white color button so here I write um, you can write a button with the class called btn btn minus uh, you can write anchor tag also outline white and um, let's say learn more okay I have to keep it exactly same row uh, I read horizontally center so align item center it comes in horizontally center but I want rounded and this color and uh, you can do one thing you can write extra is btn minus block level so it occupy the complete column white but I need to be rounded and uh, uh, border I have to change so I can write text till yeah text color change but border not change let's let's make that part now so it is btn outline white copy back to here so let's add learn more section so dot btn outline white I'm not changing the class name but I'm just changing the only styles so the border two pixels solid my uh, this color so not apply you can write important applied when I keep a cursor and one more thing we need to make a full rounded actually I'll do one thing the complete whatever the global styles I'll write here uh, at the starting I write some global styles dot btn so any button you write that i want to be border radius 50 pixels so complete rounded buttons i want so if you give wherever the class btn complete rounded okay so it is also rounded because it's also btn and one more thing is when i keep a cursor i want to, i don't want this white i want some teal color only with some glow uh, what i do is copy this and paste it colon hover um, border same border is same color is also a same and also I need some little box shadow 0 0 10 pixels and uh, my color so when I keep a cursor yes it's glow like this it's fine so this is learn more section and then uh, this part I think this is very easy um, container row half of the half text half image okay so this is the courses uh, section again so back to here let's add a comment 
courses section yeah here i write a section uh, the class called uh, p4 and uh, bg teal text by default is dark and keep a uh, text uh, center um, not required keep it left only fine uh, inside i have a container one row in that one single column no call md6 half half of so call md6 um, again okay so here we have a react codes so i write h2 uh, react codes inside i write a p with the class called leader uh, some text you can write some lorem uh, 40 tab or 50 tab whatever check it out yeah you got some text and right side we need to have an image uh, it's another column d6 yeah here i write image image uh, i write image tag or image sorry image src uh, images folder slash uh, react dot jpg and the uh, class uh, image fluid and i have to give the same class like this so this is gallery image i just give the same class again so you get the same style sir yeah looks good but i have to keep it center uh, horizontally so that is uh, align item center if you give this horizontally center of uh, this thing and but react course looks very smaller i'll make some h1 okay looks good uh, or else you can do h2 with font size uh, your choice and done so next uh, we need angular codes in a reverse order so should we check you get yes uh, next angular codes so um, copy the row i think not row the whole section right um, next row background color and all you have to change i'll do one thing copy the whole section paste it I'll add a BG dark text. Uh, okay, that's not textile, not required. So I will exchange the columns, and um, this is gonna be the Angular dot JPG. This is Angular quotes. Check it out. Yeah, I got it. But I need this to be a text white, I'll write text to white yeah but this is i want to be teal color only the heading so heading i write uh, the class called text uh, teal so angular course text teal fine uh, and then next uh bootstrap is, is, is same as it's same as react so copy that copy i paste it below and uh, everything same this is bootstrap course bootstrap codes and uh, image bootstrap.jpg um yeah that's it so check it out so you have react codes angular codes and bootstrap codes fine this is the courses section and um, yeah next we have uh, meet the trainers and the contact and the footer okay so this part we'll see in the next video so thank you so much for joining and we'll meet in the next video thank you